Good morning, everybody. Look at the calcium dish. Every night they do that. Not exactly sure why. They just look in the dish, but they walk through it, and then they lick the ground. And Anyways, that's not the purpose of this video. Um, I'm not sure if she, she went back in her hide. Savannah's doing pretty good. She doesn't seem to be breathing as labored. Um, <coughs> it's not a lot of fun giving the geckos medicine. No matter how minuscule the amount is, they want to wiggle and they don't want to take it. So I'll show later how I'm, I'm feeding one of the other girls or the male. I've never hand fed either either the girls or the male. So the only one that I've been hand feeding is Scorpion because she was sick while she was pregnant. So in order for her to get some nutrients so she gives something back to her eggs, I was giving her high protein shake, slurry, whatever you want to call it. Anyway, she seems to be doing really well. She wasn't uh, eating very much at all. I'll give you a little peek. Like, it seems as though her tail is bigger. You'll see. I know, this cage is so noisy. I'm going to try to fix it today. Or get it fixed. <laughs> okay, I think Scorpion is in this hut. Let's see. Hi. Where's my baby? See her tail? It's actually noticeably bigger. I'm taking pictures like every day to see if I can see a difference, and there's definitely a difference. Now her body itself is, is taking longer to get bigger. Is that normal? Hmm. And if there's any breeders out there, I have a question. Is it true that the females carry the sperm for up to a year, or is it just every copulation she gets fertilized and that's how the eggs get fertilized? There's uh, many different sites that say many different things, so I'm just asking. I'd rather her not have any eggs. I would rather her get healthy first, and then um, that's about it. Scorpion's doing better so far, as I can see. She's so cute. Yeah, she's so cute. She usually looks at me. Baby. Are you hungry? Let's see if she'll eat a mealworm. You don't know what that is, eh? I never had a mealworm dish until I got the new ones and the breeder said that I should place a dish of mealworms. So I had to buy like these little teeny, teeny, teeny little steel measuring cups so she could get into it. But she doesn't seem like she wants huh? Gotta go through that. There's a lot of like it's a dead mealworm. Get it. Mm, he doesn't know what it's for. Let's see, 
It was pretty bad aim, but it was to be expected. Where I hand fed her for so long, she's just probably not used to it. In this container, she's definitely not. There you go. Well, see, she's got really long. I try to give her just like, you know, some mullish ones. She's so hungry. She didn't eat for so long. She's just starving. Look, baby girl, right here. There. Oh, there you go. No. See, she just, they just fall out of her mouth. That's not food, baby girl. I don't even know what the fuck you just ate. I mean... I cut... <clears throat> Excuse me. I try to keep track of what they're actually eating because um, just to see if they're maintaining the nutrients that the food that they're actually eating. And she likes to see food move. To order one of those dishes, but make them move. There you go. She's my spoiled little girl. Come on. See, she likes it too much. Oh, that one's smaller. That was easier to get. Look at that. You must not have forgot about that one. Get a mouthful of calcium while you're over there. Come on, you can do it. See, there's a fine line between what she can chew and put in her mouth and what she wants to. There you go. Look. Okay, well anyways, this is Scorpion eating. Uh, this is her fourth day of eating real food. Uh, she had diarrhea again yesterday, but it seems like it has a little bit more form to it. I didn't think you really wanted to see what the poo looks like, but again, if she has another one today... <coughs> Anyways, this is my little baby girl scorpion, and I think she's still hungry, so I'm going to feed her some more. Alright, you guys have a great day. Bye. Parasites are bad. Go to your vet. There's nothing to joke about. Your gecko can die from parasites, okay? Tip of the day. <laughs> have a great one.